What, a guy can't have 18 shots of Jack Daniels on his own YouTube channel? Can't do shit these days. Let's go on today guys, we have Beats here, and today we'll be reviewing Thickify. It's a plugin that promises to make the things thick. I saw an ad for it on Instagram, and that's literally all it takes for me to make a video. Well, and review it. Review it and make a video. I had, I had a really funny tweet to make. Make sure to go follow me at Weaver Beats. It promises to make your music sound full and fat instantly. Well, that's that's not very nice. I want my music to sound uh, lean and uh, young. Nico Kotas, Kotalos, never heard of that guy before. Definitely haven't reviewed anything of his in the past. My basses sound completely different and almost shook my house. I'm literally at a loss for words. Me too, me too. A powerful plugin to quickly make bigger sounds. Make your basses, synths, drums, and 808 sound more full, fat, and alive instantly. Uh. Sorry, it was those 18 shots of whiskey, guys. Definitely had 18 shots of whiskey, not one or two. I had 18. Call an ambulance. <laughs> quickly add the perfect saturation and color to your sounds without sacrificing the dynamics. Bring more attention to the sounds that matter so you can elevate your overall mix. Heavy duty sound design without a confusing look. I don't know, man, it looks pretty confusing to me, dude. There's a guy, he's, he's smiling, he's angry, he's getting buff, he's shaking. Now I'm shaking. Thickness knob, stress knob. All right, slow down here, guys, slow down. Drive knob, auto gain, woo. Oversampling, woo. Give me money, Thickify. All right, did you take the picture yet? It really just sounds like a compressor and saturator to me at the end of the day. How thick can it make it? Can it make it thicker than OTT? I don't, I really don't think so. My dick amazing, huh? My dick amazing. My... As you can see, it's got a thickness knob here, tone, stress, drive, an auto makeup gain, bypass, oversampling, nothing too crazy here. I'll show you guys how it works on this uh, drum loop here. If I could be honest with you, uh, my first impressions seems a lot like Sausage Fattener, but repackaged with a little more, uh, a little more settings on it. Really, that's kind of like what Nani is at the end of the day, but Nani has more control than all of this. My dick amazing, huh? My dick amazing. Okay, so we're gonna compare Thickify against Sausage Fattener, against Nani, against Dickify, against the dry signal. Firstly, we're gonna try on this drum loop here. As you can see, I made them all match in volume, so the outputs of all of them are the exact same. They were all set to 50% fatness, thickness, thickness, or whatever. Nani and the stock devices also have different distortion and saturation types, allowing you to get a more diverse tone, as well as a dry, wet knob. And thickify. The sausage batter. The nani. The dickify. Okay, so there's a lot to unpack here. Sausage Fatter and Nani definitely do more to the sound than Thickify or Dickify do, but to me at least, they definitely give more power to them. But I'd also like to point out that my free Ableton rack, Dickify, I made out of stock devices, is better than Thickify is, by a lot. Now what all of these do to the transients is another discussion. I wasn't really able to tell very well because this drum loop doesn't really sound like it has a very strong transient to begin with. We'll just assume they all ruin the transients. <laughs> and that your best bet is to mix in with a dry wet knob or in a sin return. Okay, now let's compare it on the bass sounds. Now let's hear the dry bass. Then with Thickify. Then Sausage Fattener. And then 
Dickify. So I noticed the sausage fatter one sounds uh, extremely bad on the bass. I made sure everything was gain staged properly, so that's not the issue there. I'm not exactly sure what the issue is, but sausage fatter did not handle the bass very well. So if I was making a tier list out of all of these, I'd definitely put Nani at the top, and then Dickify, and then Sausage Fattener, and then Thickify all the way at the bottom. It really depends what you're going for for the base, in my opinion, but I'd put Nani at the top for sure. Okay, that's been a good comparison between all of these. Um, I could have compared it with OTT as well, but I felt like OTT did more damage than uh, good. My dick amazing, huh? My dick go blazing. So yeah, Nani is 20 bucks. Thickify is 40 bucks. OTT is free. The choice is yours, man. If you want to burn that extra $20 for uh, a dancing uh, thick guy that sometimes turns buff, your choice, your choice, man, your choice. It doesn't have a dry wet knob though, so keep that in mind. It just seems a little outdated to me. It really just seems like a repackaged sausage fattener at the end of the day. Yeah, I don't know. I consider this plugin busted. What do you guys think down in the comments? Is it uh, is it worth 40 bucks? Do you guys use Thickify? Be honest, do you guys use Thickify? Is that, is that what's getting you your Grammy nominated productions? Is that what's getting you your Academy Awards? Let me know down in the comments. I think I'm gonna include a free version of like an Ableton rack. That's basically the exact same thing of this. So if you guys want uh, Dickify, <laughs> you don't even have to let me know. I'm just going to include it. So uh, Dickify will be included. If you guys want to download Dickify, that'll be in the description. I give I give Thickify a buff dude out of 10. Not a thick guy, a buff guy. You know, I'm leaning on putting it on a 2, but really, it's hard to say. I don't know. You know, it's functional. Already existed for like 10 years now. All right, Rob, whenever you're ready. That Ghost Rider is really paying off. Help! They're making me jack off with hand sanitizer! Help! Help! If you're wondering how Steven became alive again, uh, basically Ryan Kyle brought him back to life, and then uh, Steven put him in a cage. Well, that's a story for another time, and that's a story I'm never gonna tell. Bye! There's a link in the description to a bunch of free content, including acapellas, uh, shaker and tambourine loops, and more. If you guys feel generous though, make sure to check out my Patreon if you want to help support me and the channel.